it's it's a it's a interesting balance, and I think my whole point now, like the evolution, the evolution of the stove from the stuff we were doing when we were doing Black Phillip, is me really tweaking and having a better understanding of this and understanding what part of it is is not just specifically male or masculine or dominant and what's not specifically female because here's a dude you know like um my ex is dealing with a dude who's just a he is and he's like a rah-rah kind of dude you know what i mean like what like, sense what do you mean like he's a you know he works out he, he controls he you know he's a he's got a you know he's he's, he's police you know okay so he's, you know, but he's abusive. You know, he had a bunch of abusive stuff with police having autonomy over people and stuff. So he's extra. You know what I mean? So she likes, she's always attracted to a strong, powerful dude. So that's what she liked about him. But the point was that there was all this other. So the nuance, I think, and, and, and to be really honest, I, when I think about it, I broke her. Right. Because I'm that dude. Without the abuse, so usually when a guy mm -hmm. has that kind of aggressive, when a, when you when a motherfucker knows he's that dude, he's usually abusive. Fuck you, bitch. Get the fuck. Blah 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 blah. And I and I and I'm not. That's why I came up with the whole idea of the benevolent king is the kindness. Just because I have control doesn't mean that I'm abusive. Right. That I'm still gonna be kind, and I'm still gonna be thoughtful. But if you try and fuck me, then you're gonna see the other dude. And the other dude is as bad as the dirtiest cop you ever want. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. that dude is awful. I don't even like that guy. I go, look, you, you got to understand, and, and I say this to dudes, being kind, loving people, trusting people is not, it's not a, a weakness. It's a strength. It's more difficult to trust people and to let people in your life and, and really engage with them in in intimate ways. That's much more, it, it takes more bravery. It takes more 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 intuitiveness and and to want to to engage with people in that way and i think sometimes when people give of themselves and then they're taken advantage of they feel like they're they're like they're embarrassed right and there's nothing wrong with loving somebody like you could love somebody and they could not yeah. love you back yeah that, but why be embarrassed of that because you have the ability or the capacity for love or the capacity for friendship and stuff and other people don't it just makes them weaker you know i mean because you can the the real point is to be able to open yourself to, up to that and still be able to cut it off when somebody's not worthy you think love is a choice um, hmm. is it a decision? Like, do you think you fall in love that you can't really help I, it? I think it kind of happens, but I think you can, you decide whether you want to indulge. There's people who I've been in love with that I just knew weren't right for me. And I left because it just wasn't right for me because, yeah. because I knew, you know, when we talk about, um, knowing what my happiness looks like, knowing what the destination of my house, I just knew that that person couldn't fit. And it wouldn't fit in that. I've I thought that. I've thought that with yeah. this girl, but I, I, there's something about her that just compels me to stay. I'm not sure. But it's like after all these breaks up, breakups, it's like, man, I, I was th really thinking last night, like, is this really worth all the all the fighting? Is it's this probably worth not. It's probably not. And realistically, you're both very young also. It, and, it, it, you know. That's what I have to put with the grain of salt. Like she's not used to that. She's yeah, not yeah. used to those type of guys. Like I need to bear with. She needs coaching. She needs to be trained. Yes, but yeah. the, but your coaching your coaching has to be. It, 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 how should I put it? Uh, so this is. I'm trying to think of a good example. I this is going to sound weird, but okay. When you do no weirder than anything else we've done on yeah, the right. show. <laughs> when you when you renovate a bathroom. Okay. Right. All right. This is gonna be. This is definitely weird. All right. You, I, didn't, I didn't anticipate when you that. Do the, right. You got to do the wood floor. You got to level the floor. Yeah. Right. When you level the floor, then you got to take the cement. You got to you got to spackle the cement. And you got to level, level the cement. The level of. Uh, oh, sorry. Oh, sorry about that. That's right. Uh, you got to level the cement. So now what they have is they make a thin cement that you pour into the into the into the you create a box. You pour it in, and then because it's it's. Because it's liquid, it's it's thinner. Yeah. Thinner, it levels on its own. You don't have to level the cement. You understand? Mm, it okay. finds the if level. If you level the floor, it'll level. Because gravity the levels gravity it. Gravity normally, yeah. It'll yeah. level the 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 house. So if the house is crooked, it'll be it, it'll just level in the box. 
Um, so I, I think so. It, there's this terminology I see: water seeks its own level, right? So when you you act like a dirt bag, a lot of times you hang out with dirt bag, you end up with dirt bag shit because you act in dirt bag ways. You when attract you, dirt bags, and dirt bags get attracted to you. When you're righteous. People who are dirtbags come into your life, but they're very uncomfortable in that environment because there's you're 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 holding them to a standard that they're not accustomed to. And so, I'm, I've said this about my older sister. My older sister is out of her mind. Oh, the no, oldest, the, the oldest one, not the one that almost burned the house up. Uh, the, the, the other one. one. She's 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 selfish and self-centered and she's out of her mind in terms of who she perceives herself and nobody perceives her the way that she perceives herself and so i'm so truthful she avoids me like the plague because mm -hmm. anything that she does funky i call her out on it so what she does is she surrounds herself around people who will not call her out yes, on her selfishness yes man. yes man bunch of flunkies but she also will avoid me like the fucking plague because i pull the veil back. you don't let anything slide i don't let nothing slide and so she's decided not to fuck with me because so rather I'm, than fix her life, she'd rather lead a phony life. Yes. And just avoid you because it doesn't ruin the facade. And so now here's the interesting thing about your girl. You like your girl a lot. There's things you like about her. But if you're righteous, right, and you're honest and you're true and you don't bend, you know, you, you and you're not abusive. You don't be abusive. And you don't be. I mean, this thing. And that doesn't mean you got to do things you don't want to do. But it means that you you know what's gonna hurt her, and what's not gonna hurt her, and you 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 already get a feel of that, and you don't do things deliberately to hurt her, but you don't you don't you don't sacrifice sacrifice your, life. your happiness yeah. in your life for anybody because that's not why they like you. You are who you are because of what you like and what you do. So changing to 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 accommodate somebody just makes them end up not liking you yeah. in the end. Um, so if she's around you and you're righteous, then, yeah, I guess it is a, a training to a extent, you know? It's the same way a guy gets trained by a, 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 a sister who is as a strong black woman, and now because every time he says something she's yelling and screaming, he don't even say nothing. He gets trained into being submissive. Right. And, or trained in a, So it's the same thing, but I, I think that's why I say a lot of times the, the problems that relationships have usually be, it's the man's fault because a woman is a direct reflection of the guy she's fucking. So if you don't tolerate this behavior and she continues to do the behavior, that same behavior that you don't tolerate, then ultimately you take access away from her and it, it doesn't even become your problem. Or she works, she learns to fit in the confines of, of what you, what your happiness is. It's one or the other. There's also a thing that I think is interesting. The fact that you broke up with her several times. Can I say one thing before yeah, yeah. that? It's sort of like a job. Not to equate it. Relationships are a job. So it's the job description. You go, this is the job I have for you. Right. If you do not want to do this job, you're fired. then you're fired or you can quit. Right. But what I'm not going to have you do is start doing some other shit that I didn't ask you to do. And then I'm going to pay you. And then continue to pay like you, you still at the, work same, here. Yeah. the same to, you know, that's, the, that's what it is. It's you define what it is. That role is for them in your life, and if they want in that role, that's great. But what they don't get to do is claim the title, then do whatever they want to do and not do the things you asked. And that goes men, women, or yeah. otherwise. So, for instance, if she wants you to be monogamous, she has to go, listen, I, I need somebody who's monogamous. She did. She goes, I have and, a role for a monogamous dude. You said, And nope. you raised your hands. You go... I'm the guy for that job, <laughs> and you failed because you had not no attention. really. I said I was gonna do it for thirty day, like a thirty day free trial. We described it like an Amazon membership, but after that, then it, it renews. If you how go long did you last again? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I love Sneeko. Like he, he just looked the other way. Uh, what? He looked uh, at the other way like somebody else point. asked him a question. He like he got he distracted. <laughs> Dudes keep yelling. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm not even saying like I'm not. Listen, you, you. He's not banging you. What he's saying is the the point is, eh. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you have to make a 30 day, you know what I mean? It's like, come on, you know, we all know. In your heart, you, yeah. your heart, you. Do I don't know it. why. Why would you believe that? Like, because you want to. Because you want to. Yeah. You're hopeful. You're hopeful. You're hopeful that you want that to believe. But the point is, you know. But you, you know, I've seen y'all out. Same girl that I saw. Yeah, 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 you met her. And she, she's gorgeous. She's beautiful. She's cute. She's yeah. she's chill. She's chill too. She, you could tell she just looks at him like you know she worships the ground. He, 
So, but the point is also it, it, it um it, the boundaries that you set is the damn boundaries that she's either going to comply to or she's going to leave. And if she leaves, she leaves. And if she don't, the problem is when you start acting in those righteous ways, what you do is she experiences something that she's probably not going to experience much of. And so even if she gets a guy who is, you know, quote unquote, the lawyer who's going to be the good guy, the the guy you bring to your parents, she's not going to, she's not going to be attracted to him. No, because he's going to, because she's going to, she's going to be reckless because she's going to push him. He's going to let her push him. You know, and she's and not then, gonna respect him anymore. And she's not gonna respect yeah. him. And so, and then, then on top of that, he might not have the other qualities that you do have, which is being exciting, being fun. Yeah, hey, you're creative. You, you're creative. a creator. You this. You know what I'm saying? You just kind of, you know, chill. You just like, I mean, it's funny because we, we yo man school two o two. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man. Put your happiness first, because if you don't, they won't.